Hello, my name is Bob Maximchuk, and welcome to another in the Pragmatic Agile Q&A series. This question we often hear from management who is new to Agile or just starting to go through an Agile transformation. When will we be done? Meaning, when will our projects be done? They're usually used to a project manager giving them a project estimate very early in the project based on very lightweight data and they put a lot of credence in that and finance is based on that etc. Now Agile comes along and introduces a whole bunch of new terms backlog, velocity, sprints. The managers have no idea what these mean or how they can use this information to divine when the end of the project may be. It's important that we show them quickly how these are used so they can get an idea and have some confidence when their projects will be done. Here you see a plot of cumulative points on the right. This is the total number of points in the product backlog reaching up to its maximum in this case of 391 points. On the right you see three velocities. At the time this chart was made the velocity of the team was 33 and that was about sprint three or four. All you have to do is plot out that line 33 points per sprint until you reach the maximum 391 points and that shows you that this project is projected to be done at sprint 12. Now let's say the team speeds up. Add 10% bonus to their speed and they'll have a velocity of 36. And that would be the red line which finishes earlier in sprint 11. A team that slows down for whatever reason, say to the velocity of 30, 10 percent less than their current velocity, would stretch out the project to between sprint 13 and 14. It's a very simple linear projection of how fast the teams are moving. Now, this should change when major things change team members change. That means the velocity changes. That means this should be replotted. Similarly, this was the backlog size at sprint 3 or 4. That backlog can change in size. Go up, go down. So when you see a significant change, you should reproject these numbers also. It's not wise to give people numbers of exact dates. We will be done on September 30th 2015 at 2 a.m. <laughs> it's a little too <laughs> precise for most project managers. This type of projecting projection gives you a window of uncertainty that says, okay, somewhere in this window from sprint 11 to sprint 13 or 14 is when this project is likely to finish. Knowing that uh, there is a window of uncertainty changes the paradigm from estimates being contracts to estimates being just that. Your best guess at a point in time with the information you have at hand. We hope this has been helpful. This is Bob Maximchuk of Project Pragmatics and thank you for listening.